Now we'll find out the Poisson's distribution using Excel. Now we know that the Poisson's distribution it is given by probability of x is equal to r is equal to e raised to minus lambda lambda raised to r divided by r factorial where r is the number of successes lambda is the mean and suppose we assume that lambda is equal to 5 and r is equal to 2 and we have to find out what is the probability of x is equal to 2 that is probability mass function and we have to find out cumulative distribution function that is probability of x less than or equal to 2 or probability of at most 2 then for this this is nothing but probability of x is equal to 0 plus probability of x is equal to 1 plus probability of x is equal to 2 so we'll find out first all these values so put r is equal to 0 so that we'll get probability of x is equal to 0 so it is e raised to minus lambda lambda is 5 this is lambda that is 5 r is nothing but 0 divided by 0 factorial and you'll get this particular value Suppose we want to find out probability of x is equal to 1, then put r is equal to 1, lambda is 5, again lambda is 5 and r is 1 and divided by 1 factorial. Now we have to find out the probability of x is equal to 2, that is probability mass function and that value already we have calculated as 0 0.08422. And then the next value that we have to find out is the cumulative distribution function that is probability of x less than or equal to 2 that is nothing but the summation of probability of x is equal to 0 plus probability of x is equal to 1 plus probability of x is equal to 2 so we can substitute all these values which we have already calculated over here and we will get the required answer as 0 0.1242 And first we'll search for this Poisson's distribution over here in Excel. Now substitute r is equal to 2, then mean lambda is equal to 5. And suppose we substitute this as false, then we'll get probability of x is equal to 2. That is the probability mass function, which we have already calculated. Similarly, if we substitute true over here, then we will get the cumulative distribution function that is probability of x less than or equal to 2. That value is 0.1246 which already we have calculated.